With the triangle mask, we've got an interesting effect layered over a full screen image. You can get creative on this and see how you might be able to use it. So we've got a button that says click for more. When you click on it, it zooms out and it reveals the image behind. Then there's a close button you can click to close it up and then uh, you can scroll down further. This is also nicely responsive. So let's do that. So how do, how do you change this? All, all of these can be updated inside the module settings. So let's first go and update the close button. So there's the image, of course. Uh, you just keep scrolling. There you're gonna see the image. Uh, this you can upload. And just make sure that you use a, a big image if you wanna use it full screen. Um, don't make it too big, otherwise it's um, going to be a problem for the page to load. So crunch the image, make it small, but then um, also make sure that it doesn't distort if it needs to stretch to full screen. So that's the image settings. Let's go and have a look at the button. Uh, the button we want to change to a different color. Uh, there we go. I'm just going to go with a uh, green over here. There we go, we'll just go with that one. And then we want to go to the advanced settings because we want to change, um, okay, I'm not sure. That, there we go. So we want to change this uh, background color there. Let's close this out for, for that diagonal line. The diagonal line is in the advanced settings and here you'll see a background color uh, I recognize that EB, EB color, that's gray. And then just scroll through and see if there's anything further. If there's nothing, we can save and exit. So that's the close button done. Next, we want to go to the rest of the item. So there's a click more button uh, on the front and some text. These uh, elements that you have here, we've labeled it out. So mask one, mask border two, mask border three. Do not delete these. We've indicated it clearly, otherwise it will break the layers on the effect. So if you wanna create more of these, you're just gonna duplicate the entire module as a set, or you're gonna duplicate this row module uh, in order to create more of these. So let's look at the click more button. So click for more. Um, you can update that text, obviously. Let's go to design. And then there we're gonna change to another green again. Um, and then let's see what else there is. There was the gray diagonal line as well. So we go to advanced. And I'm just gonna update that again over there. And let's have a final look. There we go. So now we can preview. So that's been updated. And uh, let's save. Let's update. And let's do a final review. There we go. So that's updated. I'll show you where to do that in a sec. When you click for more, that's also there. So you can close it up and we set over there. So um, let's look about and we are awesome. Normally we have it labeled that. So there it is the about text then you can go to design and that's where you updated there the gray and the screen i mean the purple uh, so save update and then reload there we go that's updated so that's how you update this triangle mask thanks for watching